Can I eat rice if I have diabetes? How do carbohydrates affect diabetes? People with diabetes have an impaired ability to produce insulin, use insulin, or both. People with type 1 diabetes cannot produce insulin, so they take insulin to make sure the cells can get the sugar they need for energy. People with type 2 diabetes are often insulin resistant. They also often have difficulty producing enough insulin to keep their blood sugar in the normal range. Is eating rice healthy with diabetes? High carbohydrate foods like grains, cereals, pasta, rice, and starchy vegetables are not forbidden. But they should be eaten in moderation. Rice is a high carbohydrate grain, but it can be incorporated into meals in appropriate amounts. One third of a cup of rice has 15 grams of carbohydrate. That accounts for one fourth to one third of the amount of carbohydrate recommended for a single meal, if the target is 45 to 60 grams of carbohydrate per meal. Meals that also include healthy proteins and fats can help to slow the impact of the rice on blood sugar levels. Nutritious and delicious alternatives to rice. Because rice is high in carbohydrates, it should be accompanied by other foods. Vegetables are high in fiber, vitamins, and other nutrients. Vegetables are made of carbohydrates, but at a much lower level than grains. Eating foods that are lower in carbohydrates and higher in fiber can make meals more satisfying. For example, one half cup of rice has 22 grams of carbohydrate. In contrast, one cup of squash only has 8 grams of carbohydrate. Many foods can serve as substitutes for rice. Examples include cauliflower, mushrooms, and eggplant. Quinoa contains the same amount of carbohydrates as rice, but it has more protein, and some types have more fiber.